Linkin Park is an American band from Los Angeles, California. Formed in 1996, the band rose to international fame with their debut album, Hybrid Theory. Over their career, Linkin Park have sold over 50 million albums worldwide and won multiple music awards, including two Grammys, and were recently named the best live act in the world by MTV Europe. While on tour in Australia, bassist Phoenix stopped by the EA Sports office in Sydney to play a few games online against lucky fans and tell us his thoughts on the beautiful game and what it's like to be part of EA Sports FIFA 11. Sydney's one of my favourite places to, to play and visit, so it almost feels like a half of a vacation. It's not just a tour, but to actually relax and do a lot of fun stuff as well. I got a couple favourite soccer teams. Um, favorite in the U.S. is probably the LA Galaxy right now. I've, uh, that's the closest, the closest team. I've had some season tickets for a while. It was good when, uh, when Beckham came. Good for U.S. soccer. I grew up watching whatever was on TV, so the only games that were shown that were good soccer were Manchester United with the occasional uh, Arsenal or uh, now Chelsea games. So I follow the big teams in the in the Premier League. Dempsey's great. I got to see him play a couple times uh, already this season. We got to go to some uh, Fulham games while we're in London. And um, Donovan's fun to watch at the Galaxy. In international, there's a ton of great players, but those are probably my two favorite U.S. players. Uh, I used to play a ton. Now I'm finding some more more free time, so I started playing uh, 10 a lot, and then now with 11. I probably watched, I think, like a little over 20 matches during this most recent World Cup or so, and uh, followed the U.S., and that was a lot of fun. Aren't they supposed to have like orange slices at halftime for soccer games? I am sweating. But we're losing right now. We need a better second half. I think the best thing for us about um, having songs and games is just that, that we enjoy playing games ourselves and that it's an easy, natural way to reach out to people who might not be as familiar with our music. Um, I think that you know, titles like FIFA have a great cross-section of people that are both fans and not necessarily familiar with, the, with Lincoln Park. So it's an opportunity for us to be involved with something we think is really cool. At the same time, maybe introduce ourselves to, to people who aren't familiar with the band in a, in a different way. You didn't get that, did you? Yeah, it wasn't very good. I think the best thing FIFA has going for it is just the, uh, how they're continually improving like the actual style of how soccer is played. Um, I think it's the best game as far as just realistic uh, soccer feel. You can actually use strategy that you'd play on the field and you can, you can play the game like the different players actually play in real life. So I think the, closest it, the closer it gets towards that realistic feeling of actually playing, for me, the better. It's a lot of, it makes it a lot of fun. Yeah, I definitely love FIFA.